Welcome to H2K Infosys. H2K Infosys is a e-verify business based in Atlanta, Georgia, United States. We provide 100% job-oriented, instructor-led, face-to-face, true live online software training programs. It also includes access to Cloud Test Lab with software tools. We provide live project for you to work on. We also provide assistance with mock interviews, resume preparation and review, and job placement assistance. H2K Infosys is trusted by so many students across the world. H2K Infosys provides world-class services in IT training with real-time project work for corporates and individuals, special IT training for MS students in the United States, software design development, QA manual and automation, performance testing and maintenance, IT staff augmentation, job placement assistance and tech support. It is available. Let's go back to this machine. Actually, this is not loading. Looks like some issues are there. Here you can click on uh, home button. Click on home button. Mr. App itself Mr. not loading. What is path APK? How do we get the path APK? Wherever you install in the local machine, right? If I'm giving APK, if I'm a developer, I will give the APK file. Right, right. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait there. Now, right, so. Uh, okay. Fine. Once you get that uh, APK file, you can install in your uh, local machine, right? That means local machine means, right, you will get the path. That means I will say that C, program file, wherever it is available. Okay. Now, that link to APK also, right, I will uh, ask uh, Wangshi to provide. Now, when you come to that app, right, you can see how to test. Now, when you're placing your cursor, see if you're not talking right, please go on mute. See if you're not talking, please go on mute. Thank you. Now, now, right, how to test the application is nothing but here, right, what you can do when you're placing the cursor here, see in the contact test, automatically one key keyboard is popping up. When you observe our, our uh, slides, right, I clearly say, said that unmapped keys. That means when I place my cursor, automatically this means, right, what do you mean by that? This contact us, first name will allow alpha numeric. That means this is my alphabet. And when I click on one, two, three, it will come one, two, three. That means it will allow my alpha numeric here, like that. Now you can enter whatever the value you want. Enter. That means, right, it's a kind of testing what you are doing in the web application. However, you are testing in the mobile now. Enter your uh, some details here, first name, last name, like that. Now, here, right, once you enter all the details, what you can do is, no need to click on submit. You can also click on go in your uh, keyboard. You can also see here. So all these kind of testings you need to be handled as part of your application testing. Now you enter whatever the value, some values, like enter your first name, last name. So this is the way to test your uh, application. <clears throat> yeah, you can enter first, first name, last name. Now, once you click on go, right, what will happen automatically, it should pop up some message here. See, it is not popping up any message. That means what you can do, see, you can go back and you can check. That the steps right, please go back and check because that again I cannot type. Now you can enter the values. Yeah, thanks. Thank you for your thanks, right? Someone pinged here. Thanks very much. Now you can enter the values here and then click on go. That means what will happen? Uh, okay, one mail will go to the HTK. If it is not going as a tester, what I will do is I will write this as a defect. This is how we can do our testing with the emulator. Sir, sir, one question yeah. in the keyboard. Uh, how do we press underscore? For example, we use. Yes, you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Place the cursor. Place the cursor. Place mm -hmm. anywhere some cursor here. Mm -hmm. Now here, right? You can see one, two, three. Yeah. 
you can uh, now what do you want underscore 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 huh? yeah then you can you can click on abc again you don't have underscore here generally click on abc right but uh, how do we yeah here no here right, we are not supporting any underscore here there is no unless you can click on this uh, equal to and uh, equal is the right left hand side yeah click on it you will get one more board here you can see Okay. Okay. Here, okay. Yeah. That means, right? Automatically, keyboard will automatically change according to your logic. Like, as a developer, what I will do, I will say that I wanted to initiate so and so keyboard. So once you place the cursor, automatically this keyboard will be popped up here. Now, here, right? One one of the interrupt testing, right? What is the interrupt testing? I I wanted to test my entire application with my keyboard entry only. Here, you can see one go button, right bottom. so what you can do is once you click on uh, go button it will be it will work as a submit button right yeah so this is how to work with that uh, particular so with this uh, can you see this is qwerty keyboard uh, some yeah this is a qwerty yeah you can see in the right hand side it's a qwerty keyboard you can see Professor, here in the zip zip code field, why it takes uh, alphabet? It should take only. Yeah, that that you will not as a defect, right? If it is taking, why why we will bother? If it is taking, and as per our requirement, it should not take. We will raise as a defect, right? So, Professor, how to identify which keyboard is that? Quality or quality? What what you explained earlier? Yeah, you can see here. You can see in the right hand side. what is the first line saying that what the first line you can see no no in the right hand side i am talking i am not talking about with respect to application it is a device right you can see in the right hand side the right hand side what the go down where is your keyboard yeah what do you want which one first okay line, first line what the you can see what the device this is called what the keyboard device okay and uh, If you are using other T, right? Uh, few of few devices will have other T. If you see that, uh, like uh, what do you call uh, Blackberries? Probably Blackberries will use other T. Not sure. Quality keyboard is the same keyboard as the laptop keyboard. Yeah, yeah. I mean, most of the times we will use uh, this quality uh, keyboard only. But And what is the you, other keyboard? Is that what did you say? Other T, other T, other T. So other in what that means yes where will find that keyboard in the mobile only we can find because i yes, i yes. i have also seen the quality only no 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 in uh, laptops also like some european countries they may use i'm not sure but they will use i guess in mobiles also you can see same if you are having any blackberry you can have a look blackberry i guess they will use uh, other thing okay anyway right uh, so so these are all the things i wanted to say you okay prasad if i want to use this keyboard so what can i do this keyboard uh the right hand side uh, one keyboard yeah, you there. can you, you can use it say for example right uh, here here if you see the right back button all the keys right this will support to your uh, device only yeah i don't want to use left hand side i want to use the right hand side keyboard see, this one right here you need to understand one one thing if you want to use for this application you have to use a left hand side keyboard only oh, this okay. is a native application this is a native application this is a device keyboard if you want to use it for any features you can use the right hand side okay so oh, this okay okay uh, sir how do we know which keyboard to use uh, left or right how do we know uh, Yeah, automatically it will pop up. Like, see, see, simple logic, right? See, if you want to work with a device features, then I will use my right hand side. That means right hand side is inbuilt one. But if I want to work with my specific application, whichever the keyboard I am getting, I will use that one. So, so in general, we won't be using the right hand, right? Because it is related to device. We won't be testing yeah. the device. Yeah. No, most of the times, right? We will uh, test our uh, uh, native applications only. Native application is specific to my. Particular app, okay. particular mobile. I mean to say that. So, sir, how can okay. you scroll down here? 
yeah you it's it's done it is not there down on all i guess otherwise you can uh, normally right you can uh, drag it you can use your cursor and you can drag it oh yeah, yeah. you can drag it yeah like that. it's uh, like it's working like your uh, web application thing okay professor there's one okay. question let's say uh, uh, on our uh, machine we are testing on a beta live for example like that is an environment where we are testing on native which is like beta live qa and if we want to test on mobile we have to have the same beta live qa environment on our mobile so is it going to be like the internet connected how do we make the connection with the mobile uh, sorry i didn't get you okay so let's say for example i am testing one banking application जगत एक्चुअली राइट यूर ट्राइंग विदिटी मैनेजर राइट वाट यू कैन डू गो विद फर्स्ट चेंज द because under that platform tools only you can see your emulator then you can use this sd card so okay and now now someone is asking one person please go ahead so the testing process everything is the same we do uh, yes yeah, everything is there yes yes, 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 yes everything is there yes 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 okay. yeah yeah and and sir what will you cover in advanced uh, mobile testing the yeah, advanced right uh, first what we will do is first we will learn that how to test android mobile particularly android mobile how to test my app in the android mobile how to test it how to take the what you call log files like uh, say for example whenever your application is crashing how to take the log file and then we will talk about android testing and once we are done with the android testing then i will talk about uh, automation testing like how to do your uh, kind of automation testing with your mobile i uh, what is c test i will uh, talk about c test which is used to automate your mobile application so, uh, and why uh, is it particular android um... yeah why means right uh, the reason is right i uh, mac machine i cannot show because uh, i don't have mac machine right so uh, iphone right i cannot show mac machine i don't have that's the reason Okay, because I thought there there are more opportunities for Android, so was that the reason? Yes, not like that. I mean, actually, that is also one reason we can say. But uh, the thing is, Android is for us right. It is easy to explain and easy to understand. But iPhone means that right, so it is very difficult to install that simulators and sharing also it is difficult for me. Prasad, one quick question: How do we get the IPK file for the H2K app? Ideally. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can get in t- touch with uh, Wamsi, right? I will ask Wamsi to share everyone so that right you can uh, use this file for your uh, purpose, testing purpose. Or what you can do? Simple job, right? One second, right? No need to install this APK. You can download it from oh, download it from market also if you want. If you are using your uh, Android mobiles, what you can do is you can download it from uh, stores also if you want. Or else, uh, get in touch with Wamshi to get the uh, APK. Both are giving the options. Whichever you want, up to you. Okay. Once we get that, we need to download and get that path for the APK file, and then uh, do ADB install that APK yes, path. Yes. Yes. Right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That also you can do. Like that also. Okay. okay fine. Yeah, everything. Yeah. Uh, uh, we use uh, QC or Excel for the tracking. Everything is the same. Yeah. Everything we will use. See, everything we will use, right? Tester means that is see what do you mean by tester? Tester primary responsibility is test case writing and defect tracking. That will never change. Any any number of technologies are coming, but that will never change. Okay. And and one more question. You said law. Uh, how to access the log file, right? In which uh, platform will it be? Uh, or, Sorry. Um, how how do you access the log file? You said the in which. That that's what right. That I need to write. So I cannot uh, write explain in a like what you call. It is fly and all I cannot explain. There is a lot of steps to get that uh, what do you call log file. Okay. 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 Fine. Sir, yeah. I think this question and people just come in my question. Okay. Uh, so basically, we can test an application on let's say metal IP environment. 
native environment and i want to the same application on mobile how do i uh, you know get that application on my mobile do i have to uh, because it's, it's on uh, let's say metal like is on on my computer i want the same application on my mobile how do i get that on my mobile if you want to get that application mobile first developer has to develop that the apk file then only you can install that app into your mobile okay uh huh So the, when the developer develops the APK file, we install the APK file on our mobile. Then we can get that native application, the test environment on our mobile. Right, right. First, it is developed in that mobile. Then only you can uh, install into your. Uh, yeah. What do you call? You can install in your uh, device. Okay. So native application has to be developed in uh, with uh, so the developer has to develop it in the APK, right? That's what. Right, right. Mean? Right, right. Developer has to do that. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, thanks, team. Like uh, we are already right. I mean, we spend lot of time like so too too much. Okay, anyway, like right. Uh, I'm done with this and uh, right. Uh, please. Right, That's all. Thank you so much for your patience and taking. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah. Uh, Prasad, thank you very much. We have uh, yeah. learned a lot from the basic course. Yeah. This basic course was really very helpful. Thank you very much. Yeah, and team, right? I'm requesting, right? All of you, right? Please uh, give your uh, valuable uh, reviews. Thank you. Prasad, after downloading, I'll share it with you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Okay. Thank you. Thanks, sir. You will get the PPT, right, sir? Sir. Uh, yeah, PPT is already shared. Uh, today's uh, today's uh, will you update and do it? Okay. Okay. So many of our students have given testimonials on how our training programs are. You will find them on kudzu.com and on our website h2kinfosys.com. On our website h2kinfosys.com, you will also find more detailed information on who we are, the courses that we offer, what each course covers. Also, if you're interested in a demo program, please register on our homepage on the left-hand side. Just give us more information about yourself and we will send you a link for a demo class. The demo class is absolutely free. Experience our commitment by just attending an orientation workshop at no cost. Our team of faculty and advisors are here to guide you with the right information if you still have more questions please feel free to call us call us at 770 777 this is a united states number if you're calling from the uk call us at 020 337 One seven six one five. You can also email us at training at h two k infosys dot com or h two k infosys at gmail dot com. Thank you for watching our videos. We wish you a great career in information technology.